Hey, Benjamin from Eclipse here. Quick video to show you what I did with my Rapiro robot that I got from Element 14. And uh, basically what I did is that I turned the robot into an IoT device thanks to Eclipse Orion in order to enable development right onto the robot from my web browser and um, MQTT, MQTT allowing me to control the robot uh, over the internet. So without further ado, let's look at uh, Orion. Uh, so let's open a web browser. Um, so this web browser, um, I'm going to basically open the URL corresponding to my Raspberry Pi, launch Orion. Um, okay, we can see that I already have a project. Um, this is the project I want to edit. Uh, this is my main script. And so basically a few, a few lines of JavaScript code to subscribe to the IoT.Eclipse.org and QTT broker. Listen to command and what we want to do is forward these commands to the robot. So in order to launch the application, we can use the Orion shell uh, node start main.js. This is the name of our application. We'll wait for a bit. OK, the application is now running and me to wrap Piro. This is my robot. And so what I'm going to use is a web UI that I developed uses MQTT over WebSockets to send commands to the robot. So here's my Android tablet. And if I press the wave hands button, I send an MQTT message that the robot receives, starts waving hands. Stop, please, Mr. Robot, now take a picture. We can see that the LED is briefly glowing. Pictures taken, sent over MQTT. And now let's go for a walk. Thanks, Rapiro. Um, I think uh, you get a fair idea of what happened here. And if we go back to the browser, we can see that uh, thanks to the, the, the node shell, we actually have trace, traces corresponding to what happened here. So that's basically the idea. Uh, very simple demo. Uh, you install Orion on the Raspberry Pi, start developing your JavaScript app, uh, listen to MQTT commands. Uh, as soon as an MQTT command is received, it's, se it's sent to the, to the Rapiro Arduino-based controller. And that's basically the idea. So if you want to learn more, uh, please check out iot.eclipse.org and, and learn more about um, MQTT and all the other open source technologies that we have around IoT. Thanks.